Okay, I just want to show how I got the C-clips out of this seven and a half inch Ford. It's a 1994 Ranger, uh, 373 rear end. Of course, I did this bolt earlier. Got to rotate this around. These can be tight. Uh, it's eight millimeter, five sixteenths inch head. Sometimes they break. But anyways, on this particular one, this will not clear over here. Kind of surprised me. So that's what this, what the purpose of this video is. So I was able to get the C clips out by rotating this around to like this, pushing the axle forward, and then fishing this guy out of here. And I had to rotate this one around like this, and goof around, and rotate this a bunch of different ways, and finally got the one in the right out. That was kind of a booger bear. I had to go tap it, rotate it around, and finally got it out of there. But evidently, I guess on some of these gear sets, this will just not pull out. And that's the purpose of this video. Um, I was going to pull it out this way, but it hits the tooth here. So over here where the bolt is, this is actually like this. The half moon is this way to the passenger, the driver's side, excuse me. I tried to get it out this way. It'll go where there's a relief, but there seems like there's no trick to get this out of here. So one way you can do this, I saw somebody had a 410 gear set, is it turns out, anyways, the side that doesn't have the bolt, turns out the way this had less material to take off. And this may sound like it's a big sin or something, but you can go through and buzz off just the edge of this tooth to get this to pass. And I just did this for good measure because I wanted to look at the pin, uh, just for curiosity. But evidently on some of these gear sets, uh, you can't pull the pin out. Like a lot of the videos show you can go through here and just, oh, you magically pull this out. Well, this seven and a half inch gear set, 373 mid 90s, you can't do that. And there's no trick. So I went through and put a bunch of paper here and took and just buzzed a little bit off this tooth. Went through and uh, it turns out the side that doesn't have the hole up here was less material. I don't know if it's just random how this gear fits on here. Uh, but I went through and blackened this with a Sharpie and went through and saw where it hit and then went through and just gingerly just took a little bit off with the end of the, I couldn't find my moto tool I just put the end of a grinder here and just buzzed just a little bit off that corner sorry for hitting the camera but now I can pull this out to inspect this so that's the purpose I want to show that some of these you can't uh, I guess you can't get this out but I've got the axle out right now because I'm replacing the axles. And that kind of threw me for a loop. And I googled this and found out that somebody had mentioned about they couldn't get this out in a 410 gear set. So it might be that some gear sets you can pop this out. And if you build a new gear set from scratch, I'd almost want to purposely, before you even put oil in there, uh, grind just the heck of that off. And that doesn't really do anything, but uh, what I've done after this, I've hit this with brake clean and got all the debris out. So you don't want to get that in the bearing, but now I can pull this completely out here like this. It'll completely come out. That's about it.